This is In Fisherman. Come here. Ooh, beautiful fish. Man, I'll tell you what, this is one of my favorite times of the year. And this is actually one of my favorite fish species. These red horse are so beautiful. And this too, I think, is an aspect of selective harvest. You know, you've got underutilized fish species across the country like this. And um, this is just after ice out. Um, and these fish are on a spawning run, on a spawning mission, I guess you'd have to say. These red horse suckers are actually very widely distributed in North America. There's a be a, a rare spot across the country that you can't go and find some kind of sucker that you can catch and utilize in the springtime, or any time of year for that matter. When you use a crawler like this, you want to take the end of the crawler, about half of the crawler end, pinch it off, and that's really the favorite part of the worm for a sucker. A couple times through the worm like that, we're fishing in a big eddy area. This is a uh, stream that actually enters our dumps into the Mississippi River. And as I said, there's all kinds of places across the country where you can get in on this particular species of fish. Oh, bite. There we go. These guys bite every bit as hard as most trout. Beautiful fish. Put your net there. Wow, are they not just beautiful or what? Wow. And they are so, look, I mean, look at the scales, how beautiful those scales are. And the fins, just as orange as can be, and then the red tail. Red horse sucker. And let me tell you something. They have beautiful white flesh, just as white as a walleye. And although they are, although they are bony, whoop, come here, I need to get the hook out. Although these guys are a little bit bony, as you're gonna see pretty soon, they can certainly be utilized and they make a wonderful springtime meal. Again, underutilized species, a lot of fun to catch. I don't know what can be better than that. Sport fish indeed.